So if you have downloaded the new update of the Maps application on Android, you're going to notice that you're not as big of a fan as this brand new update as the factory application. So this is how what you can do to make sure that you go back to the factory. So once you go into your menu and settings, underneath here you're going to head into where it's called Application Manager. So inside of Application Manager is where you can manage your apps, um, anything that's running, downloaded, and just all of them all together. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to scroll down to where you can see Maps. You click on Maps. You go on the very top where it says Uninstall Updates. And so what that's going to do is just going to put it right back to where it was, you know, factory whenever you got the phone. And then the next step that I always suggest for people to do is to head out of there. And now that, yes, Maps is not there anymore, Maps is one of those applications that always have to um, update themselves. So what you're going to want to do after that is head into the Play Store. And then once you're inside the Play Store, hit on your menu on the bottom, go into Settings, and then inside of the settings, you're going to notice auto update apps. So you're going to click there. And I chose the very top option. Do not auto update apps. What this does is number one, you're not going to get that new maps um, back onto your cell phone since obviously you don't want it if you're deleting it. The other thing is that it's actually going to be saving your battery as well as your data because then it's not going to be running in the background. Or if you do have it chosen on the Wi Fi only, um, still again, once you go home and you have Wi Fi and you connect to it, that new maps is going to get auto updated for you. Um, I would also suggest if you have the do not auto update apps, have this uh, checked box right above it where it says notifications, notify me about updates to apps or games that I downloaded. So uh, basically that's where it's going to let you know if there's going to be um, an update for you to go into your Play Store. So if you did take it all off, all you got to do is just go to my maps or I'm sorry, my apps inside of the Play Store and then inside of here it's going to show you which ones need to be updated and then you can manually do it yourself. So. That is how you take off the maps update.